Hey, Libra. Hey, Libra. I know you knew I was coming back, didn't you? I know you knew. It ain't no other way. What's up, boss? What's up? Yeah, I got a message. But let me introduce myself. I am Niamh Shali. Welcome to my Libra channel. I am a spiritual teacher. I read energetically, intuitively, and spiritually. I also study planetary alignment to um, help those that are led to my channel understand the energies that we're in. If you are under the age of 18, go ahead and click out. If you are offended easily, go ahead and click out. I do use profanity. I want to thank my subscribers. <laughs> Y'all know I'm extra. Y'all know I'm extra. I'm trying not to scream at the beginning of the video. I'm extra. I want to thank my subscribers. I love you guys. Thank you so much. I also want to thank one of my subscribers for the new deck. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Donations go to decks, okay? Donations go to Dex, lighting, camera. If you would like to donate to the channel, I'll leave um, links in the description box below. But I can't wait. Y'all know I'm about to go bonkers with this deck, right? Y'all know I'm about to go bonkers with this deck. Okay, it's called the Personal Power Oracle. And um, yeah, look at it. I'm going to call her Mirror Mirror. I ooh. Okay, enough of that. You know, I just be trying to run down my two minutes because you know I'm about to start cursing. Because let me tell you the message. You see the title, right? You see the title. They gonna have to pay for that. Plain and simple. So I'm gonna hold off on the energy breakdown right now because I want to show you all the cards that's out. And then it's on. Two of Cups. Overall energy, pouring into one another. If that is not a person, okay, it is God's spirit source pouring into you. As you see the staff here, this is about healing. It's about healing energies. Oh, okay, y'all know, y'all know what today is, right? Okay, today is pulling sip Saturday. So, if you want to pause the video before I get started and go get your sip, go do so. I will not be drinking while I'm doing the reading, but I got a um, spiritual bath waiting on me when I get off of here because tonight is full moon in Pisces. All right. So, if this is not another person that's pouring into you. It is God's spirit source. It is an emotional car. It is water car. It is Pisces, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You know what water is doing right now. It is flowing. So allow your life to flow. Allow yourself to just be. We are human beings, not human doings. Don't be so focused on what's on the agenda next. Start pouring into self, taking care of self, because when you do that, you are, you y'all already know, you don't even need me to repeat that. And this is the first card out. Four of Pentacles, Earth Energy, Taurus Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, so with the Four of Pentacles, it is, I'm, a, I'm gonna say, earth energy and I'm going to leave it at that right now because it is a powerful card to sit with earth energy but in this message this is about okay so red and tarot is power that person is cloaked in a red and a red robe but there's that darkness around, that wrap around this person as well. So that's why I got the message when this came out, as I did a pull, and it's in the shorts, and it said 
for me, what came up was someone or something has a hold on you in the earth realm because anytime pinnacles come out, earth energy comes out, it's actually in the earth realm. What's actually going on unless you haven't gotten there yet. So the first thing came to mind was they're going to have to pay for that. It's like a person holding on to a situation, manipulating, making one person think a way, making a person feel a way in the heart space. Okay, so by two of cups being overall energy. Okay, so my question to Libra is, would you have a fight while your child was there? Okay, so sit with that for a minute because the energy is coming in fast. Like this is messages, downloads, um, information, data, um, surprises, fast. Okay, so, and then, yeah, you go from two of cups to six of cups. Would you start a fight with your baby in the vicinity? And when I say they're going to have to pay for that is because this is the energy, two of cups, someone pouring into another person or God's spirit source pouring into you because there should be no one else in that space but you and source or you and someone that you want, someone that and that person, that second person, must be pouring into you, okay? So when I say, would you start a fight with your baby around, you have to remember, Libra is Empress. Libra is the baby. Libra is, is protected at all costs. It's like... This energy, it, the, the, the energy of this coming out right here with emotion, secure in emotions, a gift, hold on, a gift from the universe in the heart space. And then you got the wands. It's like, oh shit. <laughs> like, that's how I get it. It's like, ooh. Okay, so. Spirit, give me messages. Continue the messages for a Libra. This energy is like your own family against you. Your baby mama against you. Your baby daddy against you. You know, um, don't want to see you holding on so tightly to you that, but not giving anything. Because the next card to come out is spiritual. This, this, you don't get this from people. You don't get this from your person. You get this from spirit. And then everyone knows that this is a gift to the baby, to my child. Okay. Guys, spirit source. Give me a message for Libra. Give me a message for Libra. What do you want people to know right now? I'm like, you know, with Pisces being in full moon, it's about illusions. And it's about don't let people trick you. You know, don't, it, it's it's full of illusions. It's full of, um, it's, it's cloudy. It's like, Pi Neptune is like dense fog. Okay. You got another spiritual card. And this is um, three of wands. It's change what you thinking. Change what you, you got your hand on one. Anytime there's more than one, wine in the picture, pick one. You got your hand on one. Come on, you see it. You see that person ain't shit. You see they dog. You see they, 
You know, you see that they've hurt you before, but they the thing is they gotta pay for it. And God's spirit source don't wanna hurt nobody while you're still in the picture. So you gotta go retrograde, you gotta back up because as long as you're still in the picture, you know, you get what you want, you get what you want. So but but you'll block it if you still got somebody else in the picture. You'll block it because God Spirit Source can't take care of that person. I'm not gonna fight with my I'm not gonna fight. I'm not gonna attack with my baby right there. You gotta get out the picture. You gotta go retrograde. You have to retreat. You gotta revert, whatever that is, because come on, it's coming in fast. It's like you gotta back up because you know, you gotta think of the queen, like I said. You know, you have, you are able to see in the earth realm how the queen is treated. But you're empress. Empress tells the queens and the kings what to do. So you're even more protected in the spiritual realm. And so you got to understand, they can't even take care of the situation until you get out. But they're going to pay for that. And this is not about like wishing this on somebody. You wish them well. You just back up. You know, when you retreat, there's no... When when your guardians and guards come in, you just back up. That's I mean, and it's kind of like... If you've seen, like, the, the way that they protect the president, it's like, get down low and back up. Like, you, you just... And then you get... Or if you don't move... If you don't voluntarily move, you'll get whisked out the way. Or, I don't want to see this for none of my, my babies, is like, don't stay so long that God, spirit, source got to come snatch you out. Or got to come because you, you cannot stay in a place where a person is fucking over you. Where a person is playing with you. And it's mostly like, if a person is playing and it, it don't bother you, you good. Like, God's spirit source be like, all right, is she okay? He okay. But when somebody starts to play with the heart, which is God's spirit, it's God's. You know what I'm saying? It's spirit. Your heart is your spirit. So when your heart starts feeling away, no matter how that way is, if it's on the other side, side of how it's supposed to feel, that's when God get involved. So it's like, what you what you want? What what do you want? You have to be starkly clear. Okay, so now I'm gonna get into the energies. Venus is in Virgo. Mercury is in retrograde in Venus. The sun is in Virgo. Mercury Mercury is in retrograde in Libra. So what does that mean? That mean and Pisces is is full moon. So Pisces is completely downloading into Libra everybody technically but Libra because and then Virgo which is what Virgo does is very meticulous and is jotting it down so you're getting the cosmic down low Virgo is writing it down and then Mercury is checking it off your list so how do you get it what it is that you want unless you be very clear in a cloudy situation because Neptune being cloudy, right? So that's when you have to allow yourself that that space to yourself so that you can get it out, um, so that you can uh, see it, so that it can come to you. Um, what you'll realize is when when you, when a person is holding on to you energetically um whereas they're not even there that much they don't even seem to care they're not reaching out they're not calling but they'll pull on you energetically if you're thinking about someone that means they're thinking about you they can telecommunicate with you that's just how it goes so it's like if you're not understanding that okay you got a breadcrumber but they still holding on to you energetically. They not there like they supposed to be. They're not doing what it is that they're supposed to do. They 
you know, pussyfooting around with a commitment. But I, I say, look at what relationships is doing right now. Like I told you, any every any and everything is an is a energy. What our relationships doing? You got these explosive relationships. You got these breakups. You got these people attacking each other. Um, I don't even. I don't. I will not say what I've been seeing because I don't want that in this read. Like I don't want that energy in this read, so I'm not gonna. But just go look at it. You know, and don't understand. I mean, and understand. Don't wait until God's spirit source have to do the blocking. Because God's spirit source is better at blocking people than you. Yeah. They're going to have to pay for that. They get that shit back. And it's like, you think this person is not thinking about you. But if you're thinking about them, they're thinking about you. And... They know they fucked up. They know that they fucked up and they don't know how to get back. They don't know how to communicate. They don't know how. It's it's fuzzy for people. It's cloudy for people. It's foggy for people. So they're not going to be. And, and like I said, God is God's spirit source, your guardian angels, your guys, they don't play. They don't play. So you got to understand they're better at blocking than you are. They got shit going on. They can't even keep their mind right. Can't sleep at night. And please, please, please don't tell me that this is you because I said personal, selfish, back up. You need to be in the energy of clarity. And it's like once you pull your energy back and you understand that a person is just trying to get your energy, is just trying to harness your energy, is trying to recharge with you, then you got to, you got to, then when they don't have access to you, you got to realize and watch how angry a person will get because they cannot have access to you. See, if you're sitting there allowing breadcrumbs, waiting for the phone to ring for somebody who ain't even right anyway, then you're doing that to yourself. This is not wish them harm energy. This is love yourself energy. Because anything that you put out into the ether right now, you know, this is like big, big, big things popping energy. Wish them well and focus on you. This is what the deck wants to tell you. This is been in a tough situation. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's happening. I'm going to chill right here and let God's spirit source download into me the information that I need because it's rough out there. You got to remember, God's spirit source can't shoot the scene up if your little ass in the way. Get back. Allow that person to receive their karma. Allow that person to get what it is that's coming to them. You can't, The person can't get what it is that's coming to them. And I'm about to use double deck because... Yeah, you can't, you, it's like, and watch, when, when, when you open your eyes, like, they mad because you, you finally seeing the bullshit. Don't be tricked by the illusion. Don't be tricked by the anger and confuse that for love because that's not what it is. This is, they are operating in a power-based mindset. I control you. I got you. And then when you start standing up for yourself, they like this. Oh, shit. Oh, no, nah, baby. You got to pay for that. You got to pay for that. You got to pay for playing with me. You got to pay for fucking over me. You got to pay for stealing out my purse. You got to pay for uh, whatever. Whatever they did. They got to pay for it. 
Why do you keep getting this? Why do you keep getting the food card? You've completed a cycle. You're, you're learning. And this information is coming in fast. And I just rather you get it now than you have to get hurt behind it. Any any other way of which is going on. It's like it's time for you to get clear on what it is that, it, that, that you want, what direction you want to go in and take off. Go in that direction. This is going into the unknown. This is going, that's going into the unknown. Damn. Confirmation. It's confirmation. If you are in this headspace, get out. This is Libra, um, Gemini, Aquarius, energy, swords, thought process. Let them do that. Let that motherfucker be up at night. Do not let people trick you with the illusions of love and because they fucked up about it, let them go through their shit on their own. They did it. Use your intuition. What do you feel? What do you feel? This came out in the, um, in the short. They was rude. Yep, and they're going to have to pay for the shit. That's my baby you talking to. You you don't and you don't understand that God's spirit source do not play that. But you got to get out the way. Like you can't you you got to open your eyes to the bullshit. You don't let people talk to you like that. You don't let somebody treat you like that. Was that last blow? Was that last blow? Man, look here. I damn near want to put this deck down. Cause this deck got some good cards in it. Fake love spell. All right, man. Y'all already know. <laughs> I actually drew when I shuffle cards, okay? Well, new decks. So, I'm excited. So, I went on to pick this deck up, but y'all know I'm a consult baby boss deck because I have to, you know, I have to put up with his attitude. So, I'm gonna get a message from this deck and I don't have to look for pop-outs because this bad girl right here Oh, it's all positivity. What does my babies need to know? Oh. oh, that card is beautiful. I am divinely guided. The number on that card is three. It well, it's twelve, which breaks down to three. It is it's causing for a change. It's calling for a change. Stop looking at things in the 3D and understand you are protected in the spiritual realm. Ooh, that's powerful. That is powerful. Okay, come on, baby boss deck. I love these cards. I connected with the deck, but I haven't read too much about, um, I haven't read the book on it, but um, we'll get into that on a later date, because... It's past midnight where I am, and um, I did this for y'all. I did this for y'all. I was supposed to do it earlier. I was supposed to get my nails done earlier and everything, but this is what I did. I would have had to rush to get my nails done, and so I was like... I'm not rushing anywhere. Remember, I can't tell my collective, my Libras, to chill and focus and be be anxious for nothing and and then be rushing somewhere to get my nails done. So I'm gonna get them done tomorrow. Y'all already know. Look at it. Look at it. Look. Look. I'm not taking that one. Is it upside down? It is upside down. 
I don't do reverses, but I'm gonna I'm read that one. It, it, it ain't, um, it's just funny. Like, y'all know this day. Okay, let me talk to it. Let me talk to it. Come on, baby, boss. Tell me what. Oh, Eight of Pentacles, Earth Energy. This is all about magic. This is all about magic. And that's what this time is. It's a, it is a shut the fuck up. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, this is all about magic. Anytime you see spiders, it's about magic. It's about, um being able to call that thing in this is this is empowering this is um earth energy you can have this you can touch this work your magic your magic is your mind and your heart and anything you want you can have you just got to get it together you know so for this to come out um it came out in reverse but i do not read reverses because i talk enough shit you know um so i'm i'm gonna give it to you upright and just say this is Eight of Pentacles is powerful. Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, <clears throat> and like I told you, your um it's a it's a lot of emotion in here, but you got the gift. So get out the way and let God Spirit Source handle anything else. Don't be boastful. Don't be wishing no bad on nobody. Just just back up and accept the gift. Then you got the eight of wands. Again, it's coming in fast, baby. I, that's the only way that I can describe it. It's, it's coming in so fast that you have to be like, you got to be basically like when God's spirit source say, what you want? You got to be able to say it right away. Be clear on what it is. And, and like I said, Neptune being uh, covered in dense fog, it's going to be foggy, cloudy, in in um uh you might be having weird dreams you might be having cloudy thoughts you might be had be confused unable to make clear decisions and then you almost be like well i'm indecisive anyway no 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 be very clear at these times all right so eight of wands coming in fast and i i almost want to say Uh, Spirit, give me a way to say that. Because I'm. it's like I'm warning you, but not in a um, you'll be hurt in any kind of way, except for the heart space. You know what I'm saying? Like, the way that this just clarified this, you got both of them clear. You got ooh, the Nine of Swords clarified. And the eight of wands you know what i'm saying so that for me and then you got the high priestess out here you got the hangman out here high priestess is like you're supposed to already know you're supposed to at some point become the high priestess and and know intuitively and then you got the moon and baby boss that did it so understand these are moon energies they're emotional energies this is a secret this is manipulation this is thievery this is um yeah, so so just be aware. Damn, I feel so. All right, baby boss, say, give me one more card. What you want me to tell? <gasps> Libra, Libra, God, spirit source wants to comfort you. God, spirit source wants to comfort you. Please, please accept the help. Accept the help. I get up here because I love y'all. I love y'all. Oh, check this out. I went through the cards tonight. I went through these cards tonight. So, I know the pictures, but 
there's no way that I could shuffle the way that I just shuffle and set this up like this. Do you see how the universe is communicating through these cards right now? I love spirit. Thank you, divine. I literally am getting emotional. Thank you. Thank you, divine. And you know what this card say? I just wanted you to sit it right here just for a second. This card says I have permission. Sit with self. Two, two equals four. Sit with self. You have permission to sit with yourself. I want to do an extended on this. I want to do an extended. Oh. I'm going to pull the whole deck for y'all. This is the personal power deck. You are good enough, babe. You are good enough. Two, one, is changed. That's three. All right. <clears throat> I'm out of here. Um, you can do it. I promise you can do it. Don't be tricked by the illusions. But you are enough. You are enough. You have permission. And you are divinely guided. All right, y'all. I get up here because I love you. Um, if you got anything from the video, please like, share, and subscribe. I'm getting the watch hours. Now I need some subscribers. Come on. Some more subscribers. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Let me take that. Let me retract that. Some more subscribers. <laughs> Other more subscribers like, what am I, chop liver? No, baby. No, no. I appreciate each and every last one of you. I want to thank my us, my subscriber again who purchased or who donated for the deck. Um, I love y'all. I love y'all. This was the last. Well, this was actually the last card you get. Yeah, this is the card of Aquarius, expansion, unknown, comfort. All right. I love you. And y'all already know, I'll be back.